Okay, so hello everyone. I'm gonna show you how to deploy Lambda in different ways in CDK. Let me show you. Okay, so I note um, the most simple way is code inline. The next one, if you have dependencies, either Lambda, Node.js, and you want to bundle dependencies. So in CDK, doing that very easy. The last one, if dependencies are more than 50 megabytes, and then uh, we need to use ECR. So basically, CDK will help you organize all the dependencies and your code into an image and it push the image to ECR Elastic container registries and then lambda can use that image so now uh, let me show you in CDK Sorry. So I am a uh, init a new CDK project in TypeScript. Uh, so first, let the code inline. It's very simple. Function name. And we tell where is the code. In line, what is the handler? In nice dot, uh, I think you need to check handle. It should be, and then runtime, and that's it. Uh, we need to import the path and the fs to read the file okay where is the python where is the lambda code Okay, let me So that is let me check Okay, looks like okay. Uh, and then we add
with dependency right And now we need to specify where is the code folder, the folder, the whole directory. Let me fix the typo. Okay, and uh, and that's it. I will I will show you I need to install dependency Now let's, let's say we need to install dependency numpy for this to go to I want to put it in package so pip install numpy 1.1.6 tag it into here so that's just Okay, so now we need to tell CDK that we have dependency and we need to give very important environment variable which is the Python path um, to tell Lambda where the NumPy is, right? So we need to give that, let me check. So how, how do I find out that one? I go to Lambda and then I print something. Let me show I print um, C dot path and then I, I know that I need I need to set Python path equal to this one. Okay, so now we need to deploy. Yeah, check. Uh, this one should be I think that fine. So this parameter is very important. Uh, because it tell lambda where is the numpy, where is the dependencies. CDK will zip all the dependencies and upload to lambda. Now it's deploying. We can add uh, one more lambda. Okay. So in case dependency is more than 50 megabyte we need this uh, 
now these methods where is the code is here from With more memory and more time out. Let me explain. So, this lambda will use an ECI image, but where is the ECI image, right? CDK will, will recognize an image and push the image to ECI registries. So now we need to create a folder Lambda Docker okay. And inside that we need to create a Docker file okay. And also Docker ignore and uh, requirements and uh, the lambda course okay so it's index.py just the uh, same thing requirements let's say only numpy Okay, I copy. I already have uh, already prepared, so I just copy. So let me explain. So the base image is Python, and then I make uh, a sort folder in the Lambda root, and then I install dependency into the Lambda root, so Lambda can can find dependency easier, right? And finally, the index.py. That's it. So that all. Now we need to tell uh, where is the Docker file, right? The path. Um, let me check. Forget the syntax. Okay. Where is the the folder inside the folder? There is Docker file. And. Uh, that's it. Okay, check it. Oh, let me check what what error. I cannot find the image directory. Let me check. Uh, okay. The name is this here. I need to update this one. So this file is quite important in practice because uh, we don't want to bundle unnecessary files. For example, PyCatch. This makes the image larger but unnecessary. So this is quite important. Okay, let's deploy it and uh, let me go to the the console to, to show you the cloud formation and uh, lineup function. Yes. So, two lineup function one is the inline, one is the 
the Python with dependency any update it not yet update but uh, let me show you those lambda so this is a most simple one just one line of code and uh, let's give it a test okay and the lambda function with numpy import numpy right this one has dependency and uh, okay and this environment variable is very important it helps lambda can find the numpy package okay let's come back this one i think there is an maybe an error uh, so we're still trying to push an image image up. so there are some uh, some warning <coughs> but basically CDK are building an image it build an image and it push an image a docker image I mean the the image to ECR right we give it docker file we give it code and then CDK docker nice make an image and upload the image now it deploy and uh, let's see from here okay okay uh, so we expect to see uh, an image another image should be here and lambda use it image so let's wait It takes a few minutes and the image size would about 400 megabyte another option is uh, we can make an pipeline and use code build uh, to build the image and to push image now um, the image is built from my local machine by CDK, so it finished. Uh, let's check the output. Okay, okay, and then go to the lambda. Yeah, now the lambda function, and this is the image UI. Let's open it. So, this is the image UI and about 425 megabyte and uh, it contains the python base image and then numpy and uh, let's give it a test yeah that's it so uh, let's uh, wrap up so i show you I give you the note I show three ways to deploy Lambda in CDK code in line right and then uh, with dependencies and then with is via ECR uh, in the github I also do dependency with node.js you can find it here sorry this one okay so for node yet same thing package json and the end it deploy all dependencies so uh, okay that's it thank you